Hi guys, welcome back to another video. And today I'm gonna do um part four of Mia and Grace's first lesson. Enjoy. Uh that was so painful. Ugh, I'll go grab her hand collar to try and find her. Here one is. Here's a hair color. Mm. I'll go grab that horse. Uh. Where could she be? Ma? Did you see Summer? The last time I saw her, hon, was when she was bucking you off, Kato. Can you see where she went? She went. To the mare in full pasture. Well, in that direction, anyway. Thanks. I'm going to try and get her back. Be careful, honey. I will, Ma. Thanks. Mare in full pasture, eh? Why does she want to go there? Well, I guess there's a bunch of hiding places, but it's not that useful, is it? <gasps> Spice! Hey, Spice. Have you seen Summer? I don't know what you're talking about. I never get fed here. Right, you're gonna be no help. Oh, I see a horse. Bye. Oh, uh, it was because you guys. Oh, I see one right in there. Summer, get out, quick! You're always here. What? What happened? You're always here. They found you? You didn't get out? Yeah, yeah. Give me a second, yo. Hug side, Summer. Oh, no. Oh, no, you're here. <sighs> Easy girl. No one's gonna hurt ya. Yeah, they are. Everyone's gonna hurt me. Everyone. Mate, why would I wanna hurt you? Oh no, because you're so mean and horrible. I'm not gonna hurt you. Let's just get your head color on, sweetheart. I really don't want that to happen. Thank you very much. I will pass with the head color. Sorry, honey pal, you have no choice. No choice. Look at my an animal. Uh, yeah. So I can say you are an animal. And even more sad, I'm your owner. Come on, eat the head color on you already. Come on. Put this over your damn nose. Good horsey. Now let's put it over your ears. Oh, why do you have to do this? Because <laughs> you're a horse and you need one of these. You're a total nightmare. Uh, no, I am not human. I'm not a total nightmare. I just don't like riding with you. <laughs> anyway, this saddle's too difficult to get off. That's good. You can even ask your name on it. And summer and cinnamon. <laughs> Come on, girl. I'm gonna use this fence melon block. Whoop la. Oh no. You're back on me. Guys, what should I do? Uh, I'm inventing horse. I, I'm not really good with advice, but um, I guess you could um, jump over the fence and buck her off again. No, I kind of like my owner. I don't want I don't want her to be hurt. I just don't want to be ridden today. Make it look like you don't want to be ridden today. Don't just stand there doing completely nothing because nothing because no one will help you. Well you're helping me. Yeah, yeah, that's that's not my point, okay? My point is is that you don't wanna be 
be a lesson horse, which is fine, but you're a pony. So you can't really, um, do anything about not being, about being a lesson horse, but, um, I guess you can help your owner out. What are you meant to do? You're just an acting horse. You barely even get ridden. Don't say that. Of course I get ridden. Well, by your owner, eventually, sometimes. I don't know. I'm her other pony. Uh, you are not me as other pony. I am an inventing horse. I'm better than you. I'm her westing, and I'm her new horse. So, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Summer. You're not going to be ridden for a while. Yahoo! Thanks! Cheers! Okay, you want to do this? Boom. Bye. <laughs> Right, right, Summer. Come on. Yeah, I don't want to jump, thanks. I'm a barn straight through. Oh, that doesn't work. Okay, fine, I'll jump it. Uh-oh, there I go, jump here. Come on. Seizing so bad? Oh, it really is. Oh, you don't know what I'm going through. You don't know what I'm going through at all. I'm just a horse. I'm a little pony. You really don't know what I'm going through. Ah don't fall down. I'm just going to do some jumping. Oh, crazy. I haven't even changed jumps yet. Right. You want to do some westing or do you want to do some inventing? No. No, get off me. Get off me. Oh, heck, all that was easy. Whoa, girl. Whoa. Whoa. Bye, owner. See, I came back in the stable. Happy? Uh, you still got your saddle on. I know. Did you buck off your owner again? Well, yeah, duh. How else am I going to kick her off? Now using a stupid mounting block. I don't know. Like, letting her slide off? Yeah, I'm going to do that. Uh -huh. Mia! Mia! Are you okay? Hey, what do you think? Are you okay? Do your, does your back hurt? My back's fine. It's just... Summer. I want someone else to ride right now. How about you, your mom? Oh, yeah. She can train horses, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I'll get my mom. Mom, can you get Summer and get her saddle off? Sure, where is she? Oh, she's in her stall. That's weird. I can't even put her in. Well, she's meant to be a good horse. Uh, no, she bucked me off twice in my lesson. Twice? Honey, we need to see these teachers. No, no, it wasn't the teacher's fault. Who was its fault then? It was no one. Then... It has to be someone's fault. Was it yours? No. It was Summer's. She bucked me off because she didn't want to do jumping. She first knocked over all of the jumps, then cantered around, bucked me off, and then went to go and hide under the big tree. What else could she do? Well, I went to go and get her off the tree, of course. And, um... I got on her, we jumped over the fence, she was a very good jumper, so I thought maybe she's in the mood, and then I took her back over here, and she saw the jumps, and was not very happy, and so she bolted, cantered around, bolted, galloped, you know, she um, yeeted her hair colour off at first, then she like pretty much bucked me off, and then um, she jumped over her, into her skull. Okay. Right. This needs to be done for another lesson, honey. No, we should just leave her now. We need to get her saddle off, though. Okay. We can do that. Summer? Summer, here. Yeah. Whoa. This person's good. She can control me and everything. Right. Let's get your saddle off quickly. Yes, guys, this is how you get a slight set. Oh, I 
are you doing, horse? Keep the saddle off you. Put on the fangs quickly. Come on. Perfect. And I'll just climb over. And I'll go back to what I'm doing. Honey, you put the saddle away. And your bridle. Of course. Let me take the saddle back. <laughs> Ugh. I'm just gonna leave it there. I can't be bothered. Ugh. All for a good day's work. Well, bye. I hope you enjoyed that. Um, that was part four of Mia and Grace's riding lesson. There could be a part five coming, but it could just be their second lesson. You never know. Bye.